Welcome to the channel. I'm Charlie. Today I got VW Golf 2011 model. Have a look. No. Window fell off. Right. If you like this problem, customer came and said, Charlie, my window fell off. I don't know what's going on. Even I don't know too. However, first of all, like this problem, I'm going to start the car and have a look what's going on for there if I hear motor working then problem going to be not much serious if it motor not work I can't hear motor working that's mean it's going to be look like a cancer because we had to take all electricals check the main connection check the fuses lot of thing involving if I can't hear the motor working we'll see is it tummy ache or cancer? Right. I'm going to start the car first. Oh, I can ignition on, but I don't want to. Dead battery, end of the day. Right. Now I'm going to operating button. See? I can hear motor working see yeah I can hear motor working that's mean by experience I know it's going to be tummy ache it's not going to be the cancer because cancer mean I had to check the power here check the controlling unit other side I had to check everything for the electrical side before I make addition but however, like this problem, I'm not going to open and diagnostic. This is the easy way to diagnostic. If you hear motor running, working, that's mean 99% window regulator. Today, I'm going to talk how to change window regulator. I'm going to say bit confidence. This window regulator broken is cable basically somewhere it's broken that's why window fell off however first of all i need to remove this panel i'm going to switch off the car then i'll show you how we're going to remove this panel i think we need to lift up here take out this cover then after that there is a two screws and also underneath 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 Ah, someone tried to see another thing when you come into the garage have a look what's going on see someone tried to remove already and left it as it is yeah maybe customer try to replacing naughty leave it as it is and bring it to us didn't mention anything he said just fell off bit naughty because some customers Try to start the job, can't do the job, hiding everything, bring it back. You need to be careful like these customers, to be honest, because sometimes they happy to pass the ball. Be careful. I'm also, now I know, already see the one clip missing. We can see the damage for the wall. See, someone tried to remove here. Yeah, basically now I know the problem. Hopefully nothing serious yeah we'll see how it's going on first of all i'm going to show you how we're going to remove this panel no need to pull like that if you doesn't know <laughs> this is the starting point and the same time don't going to use metal thing it's going to damage your plastic using trim tool plastic it will do the job see very easy right you need to start from here lift up lift up lift up it's out very easy then after that we can see two screw here one there and one bottom it's T30 
वन आउट राइट नाइसली केम आउट राइट आई एम थिंकिंग इट्स नॉट एनी मोर स्क्रू देन ही ऑलरेडी ओपन दिस साइड देन आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हियर राइट जस्ट पुल like a something hold underneath yeah i'm right underneath here another screw see underneath here right now hopefully another clip here right and one more here all right okay now you can see some wires little bit damage right next step i had to take out this panel i am going to remove from here take out the cable you have a uh, two clips just press in little bit and after that you can remove the cable first of all i'm going to remove this wire just press this tab this end and remove then after that i'm going to remove this cable you the knee support underneath the panel then after that i need a flat screw driver just press this both tabs right what you have to do you can see this two tabs just press in then after that you can lift up it's come out from here when you going to install install to the this hook here just push in it will lock right now i can remove the panel right you can see lot of scratch mark <laughs> customer duty when i going to do i am not going to scratch anything see no scratch nothing yeah that's why professional land <laughs> if someone doesn't know the job that's why the going to be happen see the <clears throat> this one i'll took it off from here i'm going to install but however this one missing uh yeah i'm going to install here because customer done something here then i'm going to install here yeah this one okay because there is a two connectors in between it's okay okay that's fine <clears throat> right next step i can get the access for the one nut and other one here plier little bit install and pull right it will come out yeah it's out now right you can see glass fell off here what i'm going to do i'm going to lift up the glass first all right okay just lift up the glass and i'm going to use flat screw driver and just push in and make sure glass holding up now i can work the underneath this area right uh yeah next step i'm going to remove the motor here it's holding with the three screws right 
it's out if you want you can disconnect this wire harness from here just press and take out but i'm going to leave it as it is wiggle and take out the motor and i'm going to leave it hanging like that because it's not in my way right okay then uh, i got the new parts yeah got the new thingy right now i'm going to compare first how is to be go this one right basically it's look like to me i had to install like this this way and this one coming back like that that's mean i need to remove this nut 10 mil one two and three and the four here four then after that this lock you can see it's locked from the here you can see what i'm going to do i'm going to press these tabs push in then after that i can remove the this motor connector right then let's start right just take out and i'm going to just safe aside put the mark here if i need to check once i remove i know the side just for the safer side at the mark there right i think it's done the glass now what i have to do this one open then i'm going to bring down this thingy yeah it's down now you can see you have to bring it here then you're going to tighten the screw now i can remove it's removed now right then after that i'm going to press in these connectors and same time i'm going to mark which one is the upside right then I know which one is the up, this one. Make it scratch mark, it's fine. Now, press these two tabs and push in. Right. One in. Same thing, second one. Same thing, third one. Right, it's in. Right. Hopefully, we can take out the whole mechanism now. Right. Take out, slowly pull. Because this one, we can't see what we are doing. We have to feel and work and there is another connector for here i'm going to bring my flyer it's very easy just squeeze in these two tabs see very easy right it's out now right see here we are right all unit out yeah then we have to install same way first of all i'm going to check the yeah exactly right now actually i have to check why is the glass came off first we'll see what's the problem in there why the glass fell off both here I didn't see any damage. This cable okay, this cable okay. Could be glass 
came out from these hinges. That's why the I feel in the problem because look like a this side okay and this side ah yeah see it's play because this side loose this side loose getting loose that's why it's came off basically it's not broken anything but however i'm going to change because of the this one bit all then this one can get loose again if it loose again they call and say see the yeah it's came out here see this lock also jumped out yeah now i know the problem right okay i'm going to do i'm going to feed in this one through here first i need to cut this one right then after that i'm going to feed in install this one first here then after that install this thing and we'll see how it's going on. Right, it's in second mission install this one this post right we'll see how it's going on second mission struggle to install this one next step what i have to do i'm going to remove this one the motor leave it out of it ah full of water have a look ah, because he run with yesterday without glass yesterday raining that's why here inside you can see full of water see I had to clean that one otherwise this motor going to be end sooner it's okay right next step I'm going to remove the disconnect and take out the speaker then i have more visibility inside what i'm going to do right i have to drill out one two three four four for privet right all four out now I can remove then I have a more visibility this side what I'm going to do before that I need to remove all the for privet right okay now I can see exactly what I'm doing here right now oh, both sides lined up without removing this uh, the what do you call the speaker I couldn't do this job because so awkward can't see need to line up properly otherwise these two holes not lined in properly now anyway done done right now this side same thing you have to line up here and bottom this side not hard at all see very easy right that one install now what we have to do we have to bring this to latch one here and the other one there right i'm going to bring it up and after that you can see the 
screw from here bit more bit more right now you can see right both side i can see now right okay this connector need to come for the down go in in in, in go in and i have to connect here right okay right next thing i'm going to make it loose little bit right after that make sure glass bring down and sit on here nicely otherwise same thing can be happen i need to make it little bit more loose Right. Yeah. That's right. Just make it like that. We'll see this side. Now this one out of alignment. Need to lift up a little bit. Need to go with the feeling. Lift up a little bit more. Right. I can feel now both side in now. After that, I'm going to tight nicely. No need to over tight. Hand tight. Right both side nice and tight hopefully hopefully it's going to be work this way yeah i'm going to try with the motor now right next step i'm going to install I make it dry this one now see nice and dry but I don't know how long it's going to be work because water damage mean huge problem At the moment, I am going to do the two screws. Right. Okay, I am going to leave it everything as it is. Yep. And I am going to start the car. And operate from inside button here make sure it's all working just make sure easy smooth going on yeah right all easy going one touch all going now see one touch up have a look the glass yeah all working fine no fix now i had to fix this one happen here uh, right this one broke not broken basically there's two screws came out mm. going to do the one job another job came thank you 
right now i have to fix my reward gun after that i'll come back to you no i think i can't do this job because it's broken right um, what i'm going to do yeah done the amendment for the speaker it's doing the job right next step i'm going to check the speaker working yeah i can hear it's working right window done this one done then i have to install this screw right all done then after that i had to install this cover it's done then this wire out right okay and next step aposting this one you know what to do just install this white thingy to the back a little bit open the handle right it's clicked and after that need to connect this window operating connector right i'm going to leave it like that right now i'm going to check that button work or not yeah all good right then ignition off again and install the panel make sure lined up all bits in behind right after that this three screws right and the bottom one done after that start from the top just press in right all done you know what to do now thank you see you in the next video